This is a breakdown of the top stat lines from the New Orleans Pelicans versus the Dallas Mavericks. In terms of scoring, we saw a monstrous 37 points from Luka Doncic, who dominated inside the paint. Luka had another great game with 37 points. Although his usual 3-point shot was not on, with 2 out of 13 from his usual range, he had an amazing game driving and finishing down in the post, seeing a stat line of 81.8% from the inner circle and 5 out of 6 from close range jump shots. The only real way he could have improved his shooting game today is with the 3 point shots, which was an anomaly from his usual performance anyway. His distance to shooting percent graph starts off really great with the lowest percent up until the 13 foot mark being around 85%. We see his graph line dramatically decrease, way below his average field goals percentage, starting from the 23 foot range, hitting almost 0% by the time he gets to 27 feet. We saw a high amount of assists from CJ McCollum, racking up his double-double with 14 points and 11 assists, adding to his high average of 7 assists per game. CJ McCollum is one of the New Orleans Pelicans' top players, being part of their instrumental mini Big 3. Even though two of them, Zion Williamson and Brandon Ingram, were out, the Pelicans were still able to beat the Mavericks, with CJ scoring or contributing to 40 points. Surprisingly, when we look at rebounds, we see Luka Doncic popping up again with 11 rebounds to add to his great scoring. He grabbed a double-double with only 3 assists of a triple-double, which was following expectations given he has come into the new season as a top MVP candidate. Compared to the New Orleans main guard, CJ McCollum had 0 rebounds. Now for players scoring 20 plus points, for Dallas we had Luka Doncic scoring 37 points and Spencer Dinwiddie scoring 24, with Christian Wood just behind him at 23 points. For the Pelicans, however, we had Trey Murphy scoring 22 points, but everyone in the roster who played 20 or more minutes was scoring in double digits. Now for players with 5 or more rebounds, for Dallas we had Reggie Bullock posting 5 rebounds, Luka Doncic with a game-high 11, Christian Wood with 6, and Max Kleber just behind him with 5. Surprisingly, for the Pelicans, we only saw Trey Murphy and Jonas Valanciunas posting 5 or more rebounds. Trey Murphy scored 5 rebounds and Jonas scored 7. That's it for stats in the New Orleans Pelicans vs Dallas Mavericks game. Goodbye.